<clears throat> well, it was a bad intro. Hey guys, so I thought this would be an interesting video to talk about um, or to discuss and that is should books be age restricted? So at the minute, obviously unless you get it from an adult shop, you can go in a shop, in a library, you can buy any book. It can be an adult book, you know, with graphic um, storylines or whatever and not be asked for ID or whatever uh, same with the library as well which we'll get into in a bit in a bit so you've got tv shows that are age restricted um tv shows well tv show you know dvds they're age restricted you can't if you look under the age of 18 obviously you try you know they'll ask you for ID so there's that um so movies, DVDs, whatever, they're age restricted. See, uh, you've got games. So, you know, Call of Duty, you know, all PC games. Please, well, not so much PC games because you just download them. But like Xbox games, you know, PlayStation games, you know, they're age restricted. Uh, CDs, I don't think they are music CDs, are no. They always have parent advisory. Um so same with books books some books will say um not for younger readers that's usually sort of teen books but there's adult books as well um now obviously i'm not just talking about 50 shades of gray you've got quite a few adults that are books that are just aimed at adults just because of the violence or sexual nature but not on 50 shades of gray level if that makes sense now when i was a teen we're talking quite young we're talking 14 15 um i used to be a member well i'm still a member of the library i just don't rent books anymore from there i just buy books now but i used to obviously when i first joined you know i'd be with the kids teen section and then around 14 15 i was sort of drawn to these true life story um true life stories about child abuse domestic abuse you know those ones that can be quite graphic and i remember one time i came home with a book and my mum was pretty like it she knew it was an adult book and she she took it basically from me um she read it herself and she was like because it was quite it was quite graphic obviously if you've not if you've read those books if you know what i'm on about the ones about child abuse you know them sort of ones sexual ex child sexual exploitation um you know the books that usually have the like a photograph of a kid or you know you know which ones i'm on about and she was like pretty graphic and she was kind of slightly annoyed that the library actually let me take it out and um, bear in mind, when I did actually come to rent it, they didn't ask me my age. Obviously, they could tell anyway, because it's on the system. But they didn't say, no, I can't rent, I, I couldn't take out um, the adult books. I could only take out, you know, one suitable for my age from the teen section or kids section or whatever. They let me actually um, take it out to rent, which my mum was a bit peeved off with. So bear in mind, I was at age 14 and 15. I, I don't know what intrigued me to read in them. I, in, I won't say I enjoyed Well, I did obviously enjoy reading them because it didn't stop me. I just, because my mum after that time would ask me, make, make me basically show what books that I took from, that I actually rent from the library. So what I used to do was grab, some like teen books and also an adult books but i didn't use to show her them um so i used to just read them in my room but this made me think is 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 reading different to actually seeing because obviously personally i can un like i wouldn't say this should be I don't know age restrictors and age restrictors. I think those books where the books where it contains a lot of graphic, you know, stuff as what I exampled. I think probably should now. It didn't affect me. I was I, I was an advanced reader anyway. I was reading any of the adult books, but as I said, I was reading them as well, which my mum was, was obviously was not happy about, and she thought they were too graphic for me, being the age I was fourteen, fifteen. Um, 
but it didn't affect me but you could say the same about films or video games like some people who are under the age don't affect them at all some sometimes it does you know what i mean it depends on person to person but i think with books like that i think they really should and especially a library as well because i don't know it's just the fact that they <laughs> see i'm not like i can understand my mum's frustration i was picking up a book that was way too graphic or whatever and then I was allowed to, or I was picking up any other adult, you know, story or whatever, and I was allowed to read it, whereas, you know, and they let me do that. I think as a librarian for a duty of care, they probably shouldn't have allowed me to do it. Now, you know me anyway. If you know me in person, you will know that I look younger than I am. Like, everyone at work thinks I'm 17, not 23. Um, so... <laughs> or 18 around that age so I do look younger than I am so it wasn't like I looked like I was over the age of 18 I mean I looked like a child so I think for the librarian it's their care of duty to actually not you know let me rent that book out when it comes to when it comes to like buying books as well obviously we're talking in stores um I feel as well that there should be some kind of restriction because obviously you've got the Fifty Shades of Grey sort of all coming out um, and the films and everything like that and people talking about books, you may get a curiosity 10 year old or whatever might, you know, pick up a book, could be a second hand job or 10 year old. Maybe not 10, 11. Either way, kids are older than you are at the minute. Well, they could just start to pick it up or whatever. And then, obviously, reading is a bit... I think... You know what I mean? I mean, that's a bit of a... On the a far spectrum. But you know what I mean? You can get other books that are quite graphic. I think there should be some sort of restriction. Um, People will probably disagree with me and say, well, reading's totally different to um watching a film or playing a game but it's literally the same you ask a reader like if someone says to you oh why do you read it's so boring and everything they'll tell you like they love reading it's like it's like you're watching a film but using your own imagination if that makes any sense so it's still the same because you still got to visualize the stuff in the actual book so you know I mean, a lot of people probably disagree with me, but I think to some point, especially though, especially a library, to be honest, a library should not be letting a 14-year-old, 13, 14-year-old be able to rent out a book, uh, rent out an adult, a book that is aimed at adults. Can we just make this clear that I'm not on about like porn books when I say adult books, but you know what I mean, like books that are aimed towards adults, even if it's just comedy or whatever, I think has a duty of care they probably shouldn't have allowed me to actually do that but you know well, <laughs> you know it just happens um with stores as well i think there'd be a little bit maybe a little bit not maybe not so much ask for id but you know ask how old the person is and may i don't know i think there should be some sort of some sort of restriction um at some point you know because people seem to forget people think that books aren't on the same level as films and video games when really they they actually are um ask a reader a reader will tell you reading is like watching a film to them or you know you know you can you know you still visualize things and yeah so that is basically my opinion on the whole subject guys so if you comment down below and comment what you think but i know for definitely for definitely a library librarian should not be letting i don't know if it was just my library library or all libraries do that but i know in my library they let me rent out books from the that are aimed at adults but i mean it may be other other what's it's maybe a little bit different but that one let me let me do it which was a bit i can understand why my mum was a bit pissed off but you know what i mean it's kind of do you cash the library should have let me you know and um, when it comes to stores and sort of 
you know, should be the same, but not as, like, not as extreme as it is, like, buying a DVD, you know, but, you know, on the same sort of slight restrictions, maybe asking them how old they are, or, you know what I mean, just a little bit of restrictions, if that makes any sense, because sometimes it can be a little, especially, you know, <laughs> the sleep is, like, violence or horror or you know what I mean extreme violence extreme horror you know that sort of thing but yeah that's it for this um video I knew said review then <laughs> this video is so